YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy Bubai, and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today, what I have for you guys is another player review, and it revolves around none other than the new Foot Centurion Trent Alexander Arnold card. You guys know the drill, so what we're going to be doing in today's video is we're going to go ahead and throw Trent Alexander Arnold into a team. We're going to end up playing two games of Foot Champions to see whether or not he is worth getting. As you guys can see, Trent Alexander Arnold is first owner. We were lucky enough to pack him, but he's currently going on the market for roughly 250,000 coins. He's a 90 rated right back, 5 foot 11, high medium work rates right footed with four star skill moves and four star weak foot now personally i would prefer my right back to have high defensive work rates and medium attacking work rates but the way that we're going to play trent in today's team he's going to be playing as a right mid slash right wing back so he's actually going to be uh moving up the pitch quite a bit which is nice to see we go ahead and look at his alternative positions we can see that trent can also play right wing back which personally i feel like suits him a bit more because he does have that high attacking work rate so you know that he can get up the pitch if we go ahead and look at his attribute details in a bit more detail we can see that the card is very well rounded 90 pace 72 shooting 92 passing 84 dribbling 85 defending and also 81 physical 90 pace with 90 acceleration and 90 sprint speed is absolutely incredible for a right back 72 shooting isn't the greatest but let's be honest you're not really going to be put into situations where you are shooting with trent alexander arnold 92 passing is probably where the card will excel most he does have 90 short pass and 94 long pass so if you play him at that right wing back or right mid role you know that the passes are going to be insane 84 dribbling is also really good for a right back he does have 85 agility and 80 balance so he won't feel as clunky 85 defending with 88 stand tackle and 85 slide tackle is superb and then he does also have 81 physical which for a right back is pretty decent he does have 91 stamina which is insane you won't have to sub him off late in the game which is really nice and then if we go ahead and look at his player traits we can see that the card does have a lot of player traits he does have the early crosser long passer long shot taker giant throw in outside the foot shot swerve pass and then also flare passes so a lot of bonuses that do come with the card which is great to see this is the team that we're going to be using in today's video guys as you guys can see it is an 11 different color squad which looks absolutely insane the only thing that will change is we're going to play trippier at right back and we're going to play trent at right mid just so that we can get him further up the pitch and see what his passing is really like so without further ado let's go ahead and jump into our two games of foot champions see here we are boys jumping into game one and I wanted to start off by saying that going forward Trent is the real deal. His attacking positioning is great, his passing is stupid good and his pace is also very impressive. Now defensively I feel like there are better options such as Walker, Cancelo, Diogo Dalo, uh, his team, team of the tournament card. So if you like your fullbacks to strictly play defense then I wouldn't recommend Trent. If you like your FIFA style to be very attacking then Trent is definitely your his passing is extremely accurate and precise, which is very helpful when trying to create chances going forward. And that's personally why I feel like he's one of the best right backs currently in FIFA 23. Fast as fuck, boy! <laughs> The three pros that I did witness in those two games of foot champions are definitely his pace, passing, and stamina. Pace is solid, passing is insane, and his stamina is fantastic. See? It's safe to say that I didn't really experience any major cons with the card, which is great news. His defensive stats are pretty solid, but personally, I wouldn't go out there and pay 250,000 coins just for him to play defensively as a right back. The Prem is absolutely flooded with great fullbacks that can do just as solid of a job at right back if you want him to be strictly defensive. Uh, there's players like Kyle Walker, Cancelo's Inform card, Trippier's Winter Wild card, and Diogo Dalo's Team of the Tournament card. So there are a lot of options that are 100, 200,000 coins cheaper that if you do just want to play him as a, a strict right back in the defensive role that can do just as good as a job. Overall, in the two games of foot champions that we did use Trent, he was incredible and he ended up bagging himself five assists from the right wing back slash right mid roll. When I take into consideration his price and his skill, I'm going to give him an overall rating of 9 out of 10 going forward and 8 out of 10 defensively. It's safe to say that if you're going to go and invest 200 to 250,000 coins in a new right back for your team, Trent is definitely a good shout and will provide you with solid attacking and defensive attributes to help you win more games in FIFA 23 Ultimate Team. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. 
I highly recommend you guys give him a try. I recommend waiting a few days for his price to drop as he becomes more and more packed and then go ahead and pick him up. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is us using the new Trent Alexander-Arnold Foot Centurion card in two games of Foot Champions. In those two games, he managed to pick up five assists. Now, I know it says three, but one of my opponents did end up rage quitting very early on in the game, so we're not gonna go ahead and count that. But in those two games, he managed to create a lot of chances and also get five assists to his name. Like I said, boys, for roughly 250,000 coins, this card is absolutely insane, especially going forward. If you guys do like to play an attacking style of FIFA, then I highly recommend you guys go ahead and get Trent because if you do have your left backs and right backs overlap your attackers, he is absolutely fantastic in those positions. His passing is probably one of the best currently in FIFA 23 Ultimate Team, and I highly, highly recommend you guys give him a try. Now, boys, if you like to play more defensively in your games, then I don't recommend you guys go ahead and pick up Trent because defensively, there's so many different alternatives that you can play that are going to do just as good as a job you have kyle walker you have diogo Dalo. there's so many different options that are like 200,000 coins cheaper that will do just as good of a job but yeah boys that's going to be the end of today's video if you guys did enjoy go ahead and smash the like button comment down below whether or not you're going to give trent a try and then also consider subscribing to the channel as we are on the road to 400 subscribers thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video i've been your boy Bubba, and i'll catch you guys in another video very very soon peace